Welcome to the Conversion Stack with Daniel and Mark. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe on your favorite platform. And over the next 10 short episodes, we're going to be talking about the buyer's journey, what it is, how to tactically influence it, and really make some predictions around the buyer's journey. So without further ado, let's jump into this journey. This is our last episode on the buyer's journey. We've covered a lot. We've gotten what the buyer's journey is. We've gotten tactical. Um, we've given great advice. We've done bad advice. <laughs> so now that we've covered everything that exists in today's world, Dan hit us with the predictions of the future yeah. around the buyer's journey. Let's predict the future. Buyer's journey, 2030. Yeah. Okay. Everyone close your eyes. <laughs> close your eyes. <laughs> There's a glass ball. There's flying cars. Um, Daniel's prediction. So this one is, I've thought about this. I don't know what to make of it. It's a, it's, it's a little far out and it's still, it's about AI. Right? We talked about AI earlier today. Of course. And we're trying to, I spend a lot of time thinking as someone that wants to stay ahead of the curve trying to think about where AI is going to take the world of marketing. All right, killing me, just say it. Um, <laughs> so a prediction is that the buyer's journey, which today is very omni-channel. What's right? omni-channel mean? Multi-channel, okay. it's social, search, all right. Um, user-generated, all these things will basically come back full circle. Okay. And when I say full circle is pre-heavy internet days where there was there was not as much yeah omni channel okay um and begin centralized in one core channel which will be some sort of ai um that Got it. most of my engagement will happen on this tool or maybe let me maybe let me let me rephrase this i think it's going to be social media and ai social media and so by channel social media will, <laughs> social media will be discovery like it is today Got it. Um, AI will be everything else. Got it. So the like modern web browser will be cannibalized. Not web browser, but a search engine will be cannibalized by AI. Yeah, I think the, the browser and search engine will be cannibalized by AI. Got it. Do you see it as a website you go to or is it just like a Siri? How far are we going here? 2030. 2030? What are we in? 20, I have no 23? idea. <laughs> Um, seven years from now, seven year timeline. Where am I? Where am I interacting with AI to find a new product or service? Seven years from now, easy. Personal, it'll be personal assistant based. Personal assistant? Like yeah. a real person? No. Oh. Uh, like an app. Oh, like an app. Yeah. Got it. All maybe, right. maybe not even handheld. All right. Well, when the robots take over and we were just slaves to the robots seven years from now. <laughs> <laughs> I will remind you of your prediction. I wouldn't have said it wouldn't be handheld, but with the progress with Apple Vision Pro coming out, it, I think in seven years is a pretty short time. It's a pretty big time window in innovation. Yeah. The device may change by then. Got it. So it'll be yeah. some, it could be like a wearable or something. In that, yeah, it could uh, be a wearable. Phone or an implant. Yeah. Okay. Well, we'll have to go back and see how wrong we were. Daniel's prediction. Seven yeah. years from now, I predict we will be watching yeah. this podcast. <laughs> <laughs>